What's cracking, gang? I'm back with another one. You know, top of the morning to the kings and queens out there, man. Hope y'all blessed and living good and got all them negative motherfuckers out your life. Away from you, you already know how I'm coming. You know, hit that like button ASAP. Look, watch who you hang with. Watch who you be with. Watch who you, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> watch who you be confiding in. Watch who you be telling your all to. On my life, you better believe they running their mouth to somebody else. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, look. You got to watch them. They running their mouth to somebody else. They telling all your business, man. But you see the look, though. This one thing, though. God, if you messing with God, if y'all got God in your life, you believe and shit like that. And forgive me, Lord, for, you know, putting your name in with a cuss word, but... Gang, y'all understand me, and he understand me, too. If you believe, he ain't gonna let none of that shake. He ain't gonna let nothing happen to you. I'm telling you, it ain't gonna be nothing nobody else can do that'll stop you. I don't care how much they run and tell that. Like my nigga Martin said, run and tell that with they lipping ass. You know what I'm saying? I don't care how much of your business they be spreading. I'm telling you, it happens all around the world. Craig, yeah, all around the world. Craig, for real. And, and... And some people, they that's just their nature. They love to lip run. They love to jaw jack. They love to talk out the side of their neck. They do. With no, with no facts behind what they saying. They can't stand on what they saying. They can't, you feel me? They can't do a handstand on what they saying. A lot of people just love to run their mouth, fat mouth. At the end of the day, my nigga, God ain't going to let nothing go against you. Like I said, he make no mistakes. He ain't gonna let nothing go against you and be able to um, be triumph in that war against you. Definitely not. No way, Jose. Me personally, I don't believe that. I already know how it rock. If your faith is, you know, at top notch high at its peak game, ain't nothing moving. Ain't nothing moving with you, so you really ain't got nothing to worry about. But the thing is, though, you know, faith is nothing without work, so. You got to watch who you hang out with. You really got to watch who you be vibing with out here in these streets on this black top. You really got to watch out. I'm telling you, these niggas be out to get you and, and, and all sorts of things. And when you get caught up in them devilish ways and you fucking with them devilish people, the motherfuckers with all them negative thoughts, letting all the evil spirits in, gang, that's when shit start happening to you. That's when, you know what I'm saying, the cloak of the Lord is like sort of, Offer of you and, and, and he like look You can't straddle Two sides of the fence You can't be over here And over there It ain't gonna happen You gotta come to one side Gang Simple as that So you really gotta watch Who you hang with Because a lot of that shit A lot of that shit Really you know Piggyback off Off of um, um, How your future gonna be and, and the decisions you make And the opportunities You got in life Because the negative person you probably kicking with or dealing with or, you know what I'm saying, socializing with day-to-day, -day, on a day-to-day -day basis, gang, they probably, you know, sharing some of that curse they got put on them with you. Real life. I don't know how many of y'all believe that, but I do, gang. I'm telling you, that little, that little sort that's on them or whatever bad luck they got, it trickles off on you. If you stay prayed up, though, you will know to stay away from them motherfuckers. You will know to keep your ass far, you know what I'm saying, away from them. You will know, do not let them in your camp, around your circle, none of that. As a matter of fact, you shouldn't even have a big-ass circle. Your circle should be small, gang. It, it really should. You shouldn't have no big-ass circle. That motherfucker should be period size small, my nigga. You know? It really should. And at the end of the day, you should be wiser than others. You should be wiser than the people that you're dealing with. You really should. That way you can uplift them and change their mindset and their spirit. You could put them on a different frequency, you feel me? Yeah, you got the power to do it. We got the power to do it, gang. But at the end of the day, is it in you? Is you made for that? Is you that type of person, man or female? Why do you hang with? And, you know, I say that from the bottom of my heart because a lot of people, that's how a lot of folks be dying out here. They don't be watching who they dealing with. They don't be watching who they get themselves caught up with out here. They don't. You know, they don't recognize it till it's too late. And when it's too late, they dead and gone. Now it's a go find me for them. And at the end of the day, we be hating seeing shit like that, don't we? You know, we all hate that shit, man. You know?
We do, uh, and it's like, dog, maybe they probably ain't had nobody to tell them that. Maybe they probably ain't had nobody in their life, you feel me, they can give them a word of advice, give them a word of uh, 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 justification of why not to go fuck with these motherfuckers or why not to, you feel me? Sometimes people need that out there, man. That's why I be posting vids like this and shit. You know, they probably ain't got that person in their life and their family. Hey, sometimes everybody ain't got no internet either. Don't get it twisted. Sometimes everybody can't watch YouTube and go on there. You feel me? Like, I ain't that known, my nigga. I'm not big at all, but I'm, I'm still trying at the end of the day. And I ain't perfect at all, but, you know, nothing be the try but a failure. And the only way you can fail is by not trying. So at the end of the day, I be going. I be going hard on my mama. I be going hard. Y'all know this shit. So, I just, I just like, say, watch who you hang with. Because, like, nigga, back when I was growing up, if you didn't watch who you hang with, motherfuckers set you up. They jumping you. They beating your ass. They taking what you got. Robbing you. You feel me? Next thing you know, somebody going to kill you because it's going to get led up to that point. You going to be tired of this shit or whoever you know going to be tired of this shit. Like, y'all know how this shit go. That's serious out here, dog. These young cats don't know that, though, man. You know, I was with my moms yesterday talking about this shit, like, dog. And it was it's serious. It's real. And, and, and it's like, I don't think nobody else understand that, though. It's a lot of folks out here that ain't woke up yet. They don't understand how real it is, nigga. It's real, you know? It's real, but, you know, it's like, God will tell you, too. Like, dog, you, you ain't going to be able to warn everybody. You ain't going to be able to... Put everybody on the same game that you're trying to dish out to certain people. Some some going to get it. Some ain't. You know, hopefully they get it in time, though, before, you know, they're calling it the knocking on they though. But at the end of the day, it's like right now, man, you got to watch who you hang with these motherfuckers and mislead you into a hole of shit. Into a doo-doo hole, gang. And, you know, it'll be, I don't know, man. Like, if you ask me, I think. I think this shit is just, you know, it's, it's, it's a disaster, man, waiting to happen. And, and, and it's getting no better, gang. It's getting no better. The young ones, it's getting no better. It's getting worse from state to state. I'm talking about, nigga. Murder rate is going up. I dropped a video about that. You know, if you ain't seen it, go watch it. Yeah, murder rate going up every state, every city. You know, shit starting to happen where shit never happened that yesterday or last year or last month. You feel me? And that shit real. That's when you know it's serious out here. It's serious. It's serious, gang. Like, come on, man. You know, like, come on. What a motherfucker got to do to let a nigga know that, though? What they want a motherfucker outside holding up signs and shit? Like, dude, life is real. Get with it. Like, no, nah, man, look. You motherfuckers should have been woke up. Y'all should have been had y'all good morning for just coffee, gang, and, and, and woke up and picked up on these signs. You feel me? Like, that's real, dog. I don't know. Hey, I was I was asleep earlier. Shit, it was like uh, it was like at least three in the morning, I believe. You know what I'm saying? But I went to sleep early. Lately, I've been going to sleep early as hell. A nigga been like mentally exhausted. My mind been running, running and running. You know, um, trying to make sure and, and and trying to keep my faith on. Everything is you know going straight and gotta go. Work how how I planned it or work how the man upstairs got it planned out. You know so. And that's one thing, too. Y'all never give up on whatever you pray for and how it's supposed to happen. Keep that faith. You feel me? Never give up. I be seeing plenty of motherfuckers give up on that. But anyway, the church channel when she was on. Y'all know how them church channels be and shit. Definitely in the middle of the night. Um, me, personally, like, I'm one of them niggas, my nigga. I like to sleep with the motherfucking TV on. Leave that motherfucker on. I like to hear sound. Because it's too quiet and I can hear my thoughts sometimes. My shit be running. I can hear the motherfuckers. Nigga, I can fuck around and hear your thoughts. Literally. Like, no bullshit. But at the end of the day, I hear this nigga, and he's saying some shit near, um, Lord, forgive me. And he's saying some shit like, uh, you know, like, damn, he feel like it's the end of times type shit. You know how them people beat them church motherfuckers. Uh, Lord Jesus, forgive me, I don't mean no harm. But at the end of the day, gang, it was like, it, it was fucking me up. I'm like, what the fuck? I woke up, I sat up for the rest of the day. You know what I'm saying? Been up since. But some of the stuff he was saying was, like, relatable. Cause you could really see it or you could feel it around you, no bullshit. And then some of the shit, you know, was like, eh, we ain't see that yet. Or some states probably seen it, or some part of the world probably seen that. We haven't. So, you know what I'm saying? It's sort of hard to believe. And that's what I be saying. But at the end of the day, you know, like 
shit out of 100%, 75% of it did sound more true than false. I'm like, wow, that's crazy. You know, because I do sit and I reflect on life like that on my mama. That's why I don't really hang with a lot of motherfuckers too because a lot of motherfuckers can't reflect on life how you might reflect on it. A lot of motherfuckers don't think how you think. They don't. And that's the sad part. The moment you get to trying to, you know, this deep part of conversation or, you know, this deep thought it, this deep seated thought it idea you just came up with, you start chopping it up with a body. They be like, lost. They don't know what the fuck to say, gang. I'd be like, dog, that's crazy. You know what I'm saying? It'd be crazy to me because I'm like, damn, some people's mind really is like cloaked. Cloaked with a bunch of bullshit that they can't even break past their mental limits. They can't even break through the mental limits. They mental ceiling, you know, and it's crazy. And that's that's the part I'm saying, like, wake up, gang. But, yeah, man, to the next video, man, I ain't going to hold y'all forever. Like I said, um, I, I appreciate the time you niggas be... Uh, giving a nigga most definitely, man. Let's get it up, though. Let's get them likes up. Let's get the uh, view time up. You know, y'all go watch a couple of them vids. Go back some. Go dig back in the history. Go through my catalog, gang. I got some shit. Go peep it. You know, I don't just be. This shit ain't just start. This shit been popping. You know, to the next video, though, man. In the next class session, Carnage Slaughter is out. Salute.